So in this video, we're going to talk about the edge pieces. Now, normally for most puzzles, doing the border first is the thing you want to get completed, get out of the way, and it's the easy part. Uh, those first two things are correct for this type of puzzle, but it's definitely not the easy part. First, let me show you um, the types of border pieces. So we have basically every border has two shape pieces. The shape looks like that or a shape like that, and they alternate. This, what I call the side borders, the way I have the puzzle positioned, are narrow like this. The bottom border which this is, are the same type of pieces where there's kind of a wide one, a narrow one, a wide one, narrow, but they're much kind of fatter and taller than the edge pieces. So when you first start doing the border, you want to get all these pieces together and all these pieces together. And then you could kind of figure out that these pieces that have green in them or maybe just blue are all going to be on the bottom as opposed to the top row, which is the same thing, it's just that there's some black in them. So you can kind of put all the top row pieces together, except for maybe some of the ones that are only blue, which in this top row we don't see any other than the corner. And then you can get all the sides together. Notice there's some black. In most pieces there's some black in all of these edge pieces. So I got all the edge black ones together. All these edge left side green ones, blue with a little green in it, all the bottom ones blue with uh, some green in it, and all the top ones. The problem is, because they're exactly the same pieces, uh, just two different types, they could go a lot of different options. For example, um, there's nothing that says that this piece may not fit over here. And it's pretty close. Now that's pretty far off, you can tell. But there's many times where it's not too easy to tell. Oh, does that one go there? Or does that one go there? I mean, it's almost identical. And you'll find that you think you have the edge piece correct. And then when you start working on the inside and things don't fit, that's when you have to uh, redo the edges. So don't be surprised if you think you have the edge correct and you don't. It took me several times to finalize the border or edges properly. As a matter of fact, I still have these six pieces to put in. I think I had them right before, but it doesn't really matter because they're going to go in over here and um, and once I start working on these pieces, it'll be obvious if I've made a mistake.